let her close the paper. Woo! I stand with that mom. Across the country, Moms for Liberty is growing rapidly, with chapters focused on securing more of what they call, quote, parental rights. Chapters have fought to ban books and school curriculums with reference to LGBTQ plus families and promote racial inclusivity and equity. What is going on here? When did it become okay to use our students and our public schools as pawns in a political and culture war? When did it become okay to use nonpartisan offices to push extreme conservative views? When did it become okay to use tactics reminiscent of fascism and the Nazi era? When did it become okay to censor school curricula and libraries? When did it become okay to flout basic education codes and laws to push one's agenda? When did it become okay to think that teachers were the enemy? And when did it become okay to single out a student for who they are? Some of these issues have been around for a very long time, but there is something different about what is going on today. There is a certain boldness, an open hostility, a vitriol that accompanies attacks on our public schools. And we know that the extreme right will really stop at nothing to spread their dangerous and divisive ideologies and tear this country apart. All of this is happening right here, right now, in Orange County. Good evening. I'm Terry Saray. I'm an educator and I'm the founding chair of Supporters of Public Education in Orange County. Although we know the number one fear of, that people have for their children is gun violence. The other side is stoking fears that make parents afraid of their teachers, that make students afraid of their teachers, that make teachers afraid of their students. Nobody can learn in an atmosphere of fear. Nobody can teach in an atmosphere of fear. And what many teachers are doing now is self-censoring. So right now, we need to work together. We need to come together to resist this effort and stand up for truth and honesty and all kids in public schools. So SOPOC very much welcomes the participation of WAVE and your support, and all together, we can save our schools. Thank you. For many of you in the audience tonight, your presence here represents the first step in educating yourself in what is happening right here, right now in Orange County. And this is why WAVE wanted to hold this event tonight. Proceeds from this fundraiser will help support the wonderful work of all the grassroots organizations on the ground advocating and protecting public education. We also want to fully support and endorse those candidates who want to restore respect and dignity in our school boards. WAVE's vision is a thriving and inclusive democracy, and we feel it is our duty to protect the very bedrock of our democracy, public education. Thank you so much for your support and have a lovely evening.